Old Fast Marines videos are brought to you with support from Total Boat and from viewers like you. To support our channel, please subscribe and use our discount codes at TotalBoat.com. Thank you. Hey everybody, Will from Hold Fast Marine, your local boat shop. We're on the Repco today. We're not going to be working on the Repco. We are going to be talking about a question that I've been getting a lot recently. But before we get into that question, guys, girls, everybody else, the biggest supporter of this channel is, of course, Total Boat. I love my Total Boat products. I use them all the time. Um, so, yeah, you should try them too. Uh, use discount code TB. Hold fast. Uh, when you check out, you'll save yourself some money and you will help to support this channel. Make sure you guys like and comment, uh, subscribe, please hit the bell notification. Uh, we also have a Patreon account. Uh, if you guys wanted to chuck a couple of bucks, uh, hold fast Marines way and we can get some new camera gear because my wife doesn't let me spend money. All right. Uh, Mr. E Martin, uh, went through, I, quite a few of our videos and left little comments on each one and i man thank you so much i, I appreciate the comments um, but he made a good point uh he asked uh, in a comment how much mekp to add without using the one two three the drops method as most of these cans uh suggest so we're gonna get into that and kind of give you an idea on uh a simpler way to do it again this this rule is not you know this is how you have to do it it's how i do it i get pretty good results um i've never not had anything cure so if this uh, video is going to help you stay tuned for uh, math stay tuned for math so here we have some some polyester uh, products from total boat and we're going to be specifically talking about the uh, the gel coat and the resin um the reason why is that the polyester fairing compound as well as the structural repair putty um, and a couple others and guys this is as much as i love total boat this this formula is going to work for uh, total boat products uh holland deck um any real mekp really any uh, polyester uh, based product so if if we turn around uh, these and i know it's too small uh, for you guys to read uh, but our gel coat wants to be mixed at two percent mekp by volume all right our, our polyester resin wants to be catalyzed at 1 to 2% MEKP by weight. All right, on, on this polyester resin that says 1 to 2%, it says 7 to 8 drops per ounce of... of uh, the resin. So we're going to do seven to eight drops there on the gel coat, as well as the fairing compound and well, pretty much everything else. It's 14 to 16 drops per ounce. Well, double seven is 14 and double eight is 16. So we can figure this out pretty easily for all of my healthcare workers and my nurses and all you fine folk out there. This is going to be an easy conversion for you. This is an MEKP dispenser, and I got this from Fiberglass Supply Depot, and I will add a link down in the comments uh, to where you can get this. And this is graduated in CCs. So we have 2.5, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 and 35 cc's. So when we're mixing by weight, we need to convert ounces of MEKP into cc's. Well, how the heck do we do that? Well, it's actually really simple. Again, my healthcare folk, you've got this. So ounces to cc is a pretty simple conversion. It's 30, okay? Well, in reality, it's 29.574. That's the, that's the true number. But we're just going to bump it up to 30. It's, it's 0.5 more. It's, that's nothing in the realm of things. 
So ounces to cc is 30. Well, what do I mean by ounces to cc is 30? Well, this 30 is the number that we're going to multiply by. We're going to multiply our ounces by this number. All right, I can see you're all very confused now. Yes, I can see through the screen into your faces. I can see your confusion. We're going to make it simple. We're going to use six ounces of resin. So this is just for resin, six ounces resin, which we need to catalyze at one to 2%. So we're going to multiply six times 2%. So six times 2%, and that's going to give us 1.2, or excuse me, 0.12, right? So six ounces times 2% gives us 0.12. Then we're going to take this 30 number and multiply that by 30. So 0.12 times 30 equals 3.6. That's our number, 3.6 cc's. I get it, you're confused. For me, it was confusing at first, decades ago. But let me just run through this one more time. 30 is our magical multiplication number. Six times 2%, we all have a calculator on our phones. Six times 2% percent equals 0.12. Then we're going to multiply that 0.12 by 30 to give us 3.6. Okay, so that's going to give us the NEKP we need for six ounces of resin. That's for by weight. Now let's talk about by volume. Okay, okay. So we've done our weight. Again, just to recap, six times two percent equals 1 point, uh, 0.12 times 30 gives us 3.6 cc's. Now, that's by weight. Now, by volume. Well, here's where it becomes a little tricky because weight and volume are, well, they're different. But in terms of these polyester products, they are not. 7 to 8 drops per ounce for weight, 14 to 16 drops per ounce or, or per volume. Pretty simple. So we're going to just do this again. So this is going to be volume. We're going to do six ounces of gel times 2%. Oops. This is going to give us that same number, 0.12. We're going to then multiply that times 30. Get that out of the way. Which is going to give us 3.6 cc's. And then we're just going to multiply that number by two. And that's going to give us 7.2 cc's MEKP for our gel coats, for our structural repair putties, for our polyester fairing compounds. Now, I learned this a long time ago from an old school boat builder. All he did was fart around with polyester resins, and that's how he taught me how to do this. Now, guaranteed for those of you who are my age, which I'm not that old, I'm you know, in my 40s, but we didn't have iPhones or frick even cell phones uh, in our pockets. So we had to do this all with a handheld calculator. Kept the calculator in your pocket. My apologies for that abrupt stop to that uh, because I got the iPhone storage is full. I can't keep up with it. My iPhone is, yeah. Anyway, um, I hope this helps some of you. Um, I'm going to put this conversion chart down in the comments. Um, I hope, you know, it gave at least some people a little bit peace of mind. These are not expensive. I highly recommend uh, you get them. Um, Total Boat does, when they sell you a gallon, they send you enough NEKP to do a gallon. Um, I, uh, I do use the NEKP from Total Boat and I just put it into this cylinder. But what I end up really doing is buying a, a gallon of MEKP. Um, I always have it on hand. If something happens where I, I drop some or spill it everywhere or whatever, I've, I've, I've got a backup. So, And I buy uh, this uh, gallon uh, from Hamilton Marine. That's where I get that from. Well, I really appreciate each and every one of you watching this. Uh, again, I'm just gonna say, please support the channel as much as you can. 
Um, if you buy stuff from, from Total Boat, use uh, discount code TBHOLDFAST. It'll be down in the description, along with links to everything that I've used here. Um, again, subscribe, please, and thank you to everybody who has done and for all of you who are going to. Uh, like and comment. Um, comment anything you want. I don't have any filters set on my comments, so you write whatever you want. Um, we're on track for 1,000 subscribers, which is amazing. Um, we're averaging 100 a month now, which I love it. It's great. Um, don't forget also down in the description a link to uh, my Patreon account. Um, I hate asking people for money. I usually fund 90% of this stuff myself, um, but I want to make better videos. I want to have dual cameras. I want to have a time lapse running constantly. So any little bit would help. And I appreciate all you guys. Um, that's it. That's all I got for you today. So we'll see you next time.